Good morning. Friends, how are we? Well, we, me and Hogan went and looked at a job yesterday. We've been on the property before. It's for Leslie, remember? I fell her property. They were building the house and stuff. We had the 394. It was a good video. It was a good video. It was good. Nice cutting. 394 was a beast that day. We're just heading her down. We got a McCulloch day here today. Uh, Mr. Michael Wiseman. Heisman, pardon me. I got the... I got the 150 going. It just takes time. I heard you talking about it and asking about it and asking about it. Anybody that's in that position, know one thing, it will come. So just have patience. And uh, today we're gonna get to watch the saw run. It's, uh, I think it's gonna do well. It's an ADCC saw, I believe, but they're, I think they're different than the 200s and the 250s. Like the 250 was, a, was, a, was an ADCC saw as well, the 200 not, but you know, I think this one's different. I think it's more more got the 797 out i haven't had it out for a long time got a great big long bar on it 48 or something like that yeah it would be so that's 36 so that's yeah it's probably a probably a 48 <laughs> uh we'll see you outside Lots of struggling situations. Dry fur. We got a, a couple of a bad ones here beside the house today. We got a. You guys probably don't remember this spot, but there's some big cedars over there. Yeah, we got we got some stuff to deal with. We'll catch you guys in a minute. Yeah, that's the 797. That's a, that's a good power saw, that one. Okay, friends. So, we got our max rolling here. We're going to go. We've been down to Leslie's before. Last time we came here, remember, we came down here, and this was treed. This was all treed, and we did a big job with the 394 in here. Remember the excavator and the snags and all that down here, and then none of this was here. You might remember that tree, that loop, but we, did a, we spent a day down here playing around. But these big, big cedars, there's like a four and a half, close to five foot cedar up here that's got to go so we're gonna have some fun with the max today i hope you enjoy yourselves i know i'm going to damn right so mr heisman mikey heisman look what we got i told you i'd get her out running and here it is right there buddy and i'll tell you something i ran it at the house before i came on site because i didn't want to look all i still may look like a weirdo when i go over to the stump because it may fail on me but you never know with these girls but what was your name robin, robin named it linda <laughs> he asked me if i name my power saws and i don't as you guys know but he likes linda and she actually suits linda so maybe we'll start a fad. Maybe Robin started a fad. Friends, look at how beautiful that saw is. It's just glorious. I just, these saws are just so pretty looking. And that is a great muffler. Look at that, friends. Look at the dogs on these things. So what I had to do is use the two the 200 uh, cover because of the dogs. Isn't that lovely? So we got Robin who's, and you guys remember Leslie, wonderful Leslie. Hi. And it's Robin, and your first name? Mark. Mark, Robin and Mark, and, and these guys, that's, that's these boys. And they're here helping her fix the place up, aren't they, Les? Yeah, absolutely. Good, they're painting, you know, doing the thing that we do as human beings. We get houses, we live in them and stuff. All that stuff, right? Yeah. Let's go cut trees down. Uh, 
this thing. What's this? Oh, hey, what's that thing? Oh, neat. Oh, look at that, friends. Look at that. Well, I'll be darned. Mm-hmm. Okay, I'm going to go cut this tree down over here. Hopefully. Yeah, we'll go set up over there, Sonny. So we got to find a target so I can shoot for. target here so friends this isn't the funnest tree to cut down um, it's a big dirty balsam it's leaning backwards actually and I don't like it I mean, to be honest I don't like it at all there it is there it's dying it's the neighbors he didn't want to cut it for the longest time but we're gonna shoot it down here beside the house and his house is right there too fresh construction and I usually wouldn't try a saw like this with this power saw but ah, oh, what the hey you know what we're just gonna do it so we're gonna go in and hopefully we're gonna hopefully we're gonna fire up I got Ganges here now we got houses on both sides so we got I think I'm gonna cut from the other side actually it doesn't much matter what side I cut from but I think I'm gonna brush out the stump here. Yeah, this is, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna cut from this side, friends. So, let's see if this thing will start. Might even just flash right up. Might need a choke.
Bad shot. <laughs> Where's this going? Hey, is it off now? Yeah. We cut a tree down. Slow. <laughs> there we go. Uh, have you got your power sauce on? Hi buddy, how you doing? Interesting. They're slow cutting, but they're fun. Okay, friends, so here's our little setting we're working on. I just do or cleaned out the stumps. It was a burl on that cedar, so I took it. That's a five foot cedar over there, friends. Big, big, big timber down here. This one here is probably four. I went scratching five. I, I think more like four and a half over there. Probably five on the flare, though. Five on the flare. Five and a half in the cookhouse. <laughs> okay, so I got to test this 797 right now to see if the bar is cutting because in a big cut like that, you can't be screwing up on your cuts. They got to match. So this old cannon bar could be bent. So I'm going to test it on this little power or on this tree here. Okay, Sonny.
Perfect, buddy, thanks.
tree there, aren't you? Yeah. That was fun, friends. That was a good tree. Good tree. Sonny's up on the stump there now. Jean Jolix. Jean Jolicesta. Jolicesosa. <coughs> Big stump. The reason I've done that stump is the customers, Leslie and them, they want to make a tree house or something out of this. So that was the reason I lifted that big long thing up over my head. It wasn't too comfortable, but it, it, this is what we ended up with. So, <clears throat> you know, man of service. I'm a man of service, friends. I'll go get a battery for you guys so we can continue to have some fun. Yeah, Sonny. I'm putting a new bar I'm putting a new bar on my saw right now or pardon me a new chain okay I'm just putting a new, a new chain on. all right can you see this this is what I do it's on the bar right this is a brand new chain right you can see the slack in the, in the chain right can you see it there it's all slack okay what I do I lift the bar up. This isn't the right screwdriver, but it'll work for what I got here. I'll just rock it back and forth and it'll it'll tighten up. See? It's, it's a small little screwdriver. It's not it's not what I want. But so there. So what I do now is I lift it up like this. I put the tip up so that see see how slack it gets? It looks looks tight, but when you put the bar up. So this is a new chain, friends. Okay, friends, this is a new chain. So I always give it, see it's tight, but I always give it another little tweak like that. It's tight now, like really tight. Look, like it, it, it's snug, trust me. Because as soon as I fire it up, 
as soon as I fire it up, it's just going to loosen off instantly. So, that's why I crank them up on a brand new chain. It's literally going to be tight for a second and then it's just going to loosen off. 